what is going on guys this is young Lee jr so little you know more information here so what i find kind of interesting here is that uh, carly russell's job actually released a statement on all the stuff that was going on so i believe she worked at the spa so we're gonna go ahead and read it to Carly Russell's case press release July 18, 2023, 3 p.m., it says in response to the many inqu inquiries, Woodhouse Spa Birmingham has received over the past several days regarding the Carly Russell case, we offer the following. Our greatest concern has always been the well-being of Carly and her safe return. Woodhouse Spa employees have been deeply impacted by the events that transpired but are now ecstatic with the news of Carly's return home. Our employees work extremely hard through very tough times keeping guests happy while dealing with the fact that their co-worker was missing. We've been working with the Hoover Police Department since Friday, the morning following Carly's disappearance, in order to come up with any information that will help the investigation. Everything we uncover is in the position of the Hoover Police Department. We understand the investigation is in a very sensitive state and do not want to release any details that could jeopardize the investigation. So leaks, both true and untrue, can have a devastating impact on any investigation. We understand there are many posts on social media claiming certain information to be true. Some items are factual while others are not. Please rest assured that the Hoover Police Department is working around the clock to bring this case to conclusion. We have great confidence in the investigators and expect a resolution soon. We we'll see Star Room, Store Room, owner Woodhouse Spa, Birmingham. Okay, so there <coughs> excuse me, there you have it. <coughs> and um it's really like I said, I, I don't know, it's not really really looking too good. So I'm not gonna go ahead and say I believe in too much of the rumors here, but at the same time, um, you know, the job was actually pressed, I believe, by the police department to go ahead uh, to give a statement here by their employees because this is all over, you know, social media, it's all over in the media in general. So I don't know, man, but that's a little bit of information that I get. Uh, this is Crying with Bobby. Uh, you can actually follow him on Twitter. Uh, he posted this as well. So this is uh, the initial statement here. So, yeah, the co-workers are concerned about this as too and this whole establishment. So, man, I, I just I just pray to that. Hey, the doctors, if there is an abductor, that he will be captured. The toddler, too, that she described. Or if it was a toddler, that needs to be addressed as well. So um, we're patiently waiting. But until next time, you guys continue to like, comment, subscribe. It's your boy, Young Link Jr. I love you guys. I'm out.